This is GNFS News in Peace. Fire guards ran a motor's warehouse. Fire destroyed a warehouse containing rubber products, Toyota Company garage and showroom, and adjoining building in Accra on Tuesday, January 10, 2023, were salvaged from fire damage by the firefighters. Investigation is ongoing to ascertain the cause of the fire. Meanwhile, one firefighter who was injured and rushed to the Kolibu Teaching Hospital is in a stable condition. Chief Fire Officer Julius Kuno and other officers were at the scene to provide operational support. Ten-bedroom house ravaged by fire at Imsawam. A ten-bedroom house was ravaged by fire at Imsawam on Wednesday, January 4, 2023, due to late call-up by residents. According to reports, properties worth thousands of cities were destroyed by the Reunion's fire. Preliminary investigation revealed that the fire was caused by an overloaded extension cord in one of the rooms. No casualty was recorded. Driver and owner of Opel Astra Taxi nearly lost his vehicle to fire. Driver and owner of Opel Astra Taxi with registration number AS6724X almost lost his vehicle to fire on Saturday, January 7, 2023 on the Agona Abrakwasu Road in Setre, South District of the Ashanti Region. This was as a result of the unavailability of a fire extinguisher in his vehicle. The Ghana National Fire Service entreats drivers and owners of vehicles to always ensure they have effective fire extinguishers available in their cars. One person burned to death in an accident at Gomwa Dominasi. One person is reported to have been burnt after two dove trucks traveling from Accra towards Winneba and a Hyundai Elantra traveling in the opposite direction were involved in an accident at Gumwa Dominasi in the central region. The cause of the fire is yet to be known. For more news updates, join us at GNFS Official on all social media platforms.